What's up, gang? Welcome back to the channel. It is your girl, Brittany, and I'm tired. <laughs> no, yeah, what's up, gang? Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Brittany. We are back with another vlog. Facts, I, I am tired. It's 1028, and I'm still tired, and as I can tell, I am at the job. I don't know. I mean, yesterday, I must have forgot that it was freaking Sunday. Because I know, babe, he's um, doing some work from home today. I think the trucks are getting work done on him or whatever. So, he didn't have to go in today. And we was up late last night. Having a good old time, okay? And, yeah, your girl is tired. I'm tired. Like, I ain't gonna do my eyebrows this morning. Like, I threw these lashes on, but... I ain't even getting stuff all the way together. Where is my eyes? See? I got crusty stuff on my face. My bad, y'all. But yes, I'm at work. It's a Monday morning. I'm trying to get this freaking audit done. I wanted to say I had a paperwork done on Friday. But I didn't get to the 50 pages. I'm on page 81 now. So I got this much left to do. So I feel like, I fear that it's going to take me all day to do. Um, and then I guess I'll start my spreadsheet tomorrow. My plans on how I wanted it to work out ain't really working out. After the other day, real chill. Um, it was been rain. It was pouring down this morning. I just put on a Ninja Turtle t-shirt, my cool jeans, and I got on my, uh, you know what's my feet? I got on these sneakers. Of course. I hope y'all saw my feet, because I don't know. I just flipped the camera upside down. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, just wanted to check in with you guys and say, hey, what's up? Can Brittany just get a little love? <sighs> I just wanted to come talk to y'all because I'm just like tired and like I felt myself getting bored. I'm like, I'm going to talk to the Marshall game right quick. Oh my God, my, my lashes are sticking. I didn't bring any lunch today. Let me see if it's a class. I don't think it's a class today. I think it's a class like... Tuesday through Thursday. What's today? The 10th? Yes, yeah, no class today. So I gotta find me something to eat for lunch. Don't know what it'll be. I haven't ate out in a minute. Um, oh, I need to call babe and ask me to not to cook. I told you, we don't want, I went grocery shopping. So something gotta get took out to cook, baby. We is not wasting none of that food, okay? So I need to call him now so he can go and take something out. I need to, I was gonna pull, I was gonna make a little thing where I can pull it out the jar. Cause I asked the kids yesterday which meal they wanted and honey, they couldn't come to a decision. Everybody said something different. Somebody said um, fried chicken. Somebody said spaghetti. Somebody said pork chops. Literally. <laughs> like they did not help the sister out. So I'm gonna make, I'm gonna do it right now. So I can figure, tell him what to cook. Cause I don't know what I want either. It don't really matter. Like I said, it's been raining, so I don't know if we're gonna have a bar practice or not today. Um, yeah, I don't know. Yo, let me get off here, cause I feel like I fear that I'm boring y'all, cause I'm like so drained. I fear that it's getting boring. So I'll talk to y'all yeah, when I got some more energy. Right, so what I had to do to figure out what I was going for lunch, I grabbed my cup here and I had to put a couple options in there. So I already peeked. I was going to put on my coworker when I did it. So I'm just going to keep that here to have. But it was between Poke Bowl, Fo, Moe's, and Thai. So I'm really glad. It picked, it, I really wanted Pokey or Fo. So goodness gracious. My skin is peeling. Y'all look at my arm. Y'all see this? I keep putting lotion on it, and it's still, like, I got burnt up on 4th of July. Look at this. Ugh, it looks so nasty. But it's just peeling. Ugh. I need to not wear no more shirts showing my damn arms. Cause that looks hideous. But I'm right, gonna go get my food. I've missed this so much. Yeah, I had to make a bee up because it be splashing and stuff. So, oh, it's so good. 
Don't get you some, but I'm boy who, okay? It's spicy beef and pork pho. And it's amazing. Boy, I'm boy who. Mm, 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 mm. What's up, y'all? So your girl is at home. I've been at home, actually. But I just filmed y'all a story time. I just randomly wanted to do a story time. The boys was at practice. So, yeah, I filmed y'all a story time. I might be getting that before. More than like y'all gonna be getting that before y'all get this vlog because this vlog is not completed. I have not vlogged enough to make this gonna be like a two part day, two day vlog or something because yeah, I haven't vlogged enough today. But while I was also doing the story time, I was cooking. I am making some spaghetti. The boys just got home from practice. Maybe he's just getting some great reviews. He said it's getting better. He said he's starting to like it. Y'all, he used to cry for my practice, but now he is starting to like it. Um, first said he did pretty good today. And yeah, I'm happy about that. So, yeah, he's making some great progress in base. In, I'm sorry, did I say baseball? Football. And now they're in here watching football. You watching football? This Red Breeze again? Okay. He's some big boy. This Red Breeze? I like their uniforms. Red Breeze is the team that um, Brightland put for, but these are like older kids. They're really watching now. Yeah, football becoming life around here, y'all. Football is becoming life. So yeah, my breadsticks only got a minute left in the oven, and we're gonna be eating meatballs, spaghetti and meatballs here. Got some meatballs in there, as you can see. Mmm. Noodles over here. About to get ready to fix plates so we can eat, eat, you guys. Yeah, I show y'all what I feel like when it is on the plate. Let me get some Parmesan cheese. Give me some Parmesan cheese on my hand. I love Parmesan. Oh, this is not Parmesan. Oh, shit. That is powdered ranch. What Parmesan cheese said? Oh, I got some. I thought I had some up there. Oh, there you go. Good old Parmesan cheese. I had some from the pizza spot from the other day, too. Mm -hmm. Alright y'all. See y'all in a minute. Spaghetti and meatballs. So good, so good. The daddy plate. Here are the boys' plates. Let it cool off a little bit. Before they come to the table. The yummy. See I already did his bread. Of course. <laughs> What's up you guys? It is Tuesday. Oh my god. These big old birds in our neighborhood, honey. We gotta get some trees down because the birds just wanna stay here. Just our big old, I don't think it was the owl. It's a hawk, but yeah, the owls are back. They come every summer. That's not what I was coming for, but that bird just, I just saw them big old wings staying when it was flying. Anyway, it's Tuesday. Um, and I'm on the way to the jizz up. Jizz up, the jizz up, the jizz up. Y'all, first of all, I need to know some good edge control. Why does edge control not hold my hair? Like, I cannot have baby hairs if it ain't on no lace. My hair don't do not do baby hairs. I was souping that hair so cute. By the time I start moving around a little bit, y'all, the baby hairs were gone. Like, I had souped it up so cute. I was like, okay, baby hairs. Oops, sorry, y'all. Okay, I'm telling y'all, sorry, it's all in my face. But yeah, I had some of things look so good and then they just started unraveling. Like, what the heck? I need some good edge control. Like, I don't know what kind of hair I got and why it don't, why edge control don't work on me. Maybe I need to start using some black girl gel again. Honey, I ain't even bought no gel gel in forever. But like the black one that we used to use back in the day to soup and do them ponytails. Maybe I need to use that again because the little new soft edge control stuff. It don't do it don't do nothing for me. It don't do nothing for me. But anyhow, y'all, it is Tuesday. I'm trying to check on my gas look like I'm trying to my goal for this week is not to spend any money. Is that crazy? I bought groceries on Sunday. Y'all know that. So my goal is literally to cook, 
dinner Monday through Thursday. I should not have to eat out for lunch. Yesterday I ate out. That was the one day I knew I was going to have to eat out. We got classes at work the rest of this week, Tuesday through Friday. As y'all know, it's not a guarantee that they'll have enough food for us. But I did make a lot of spaghetti last night. So, like, today I brought spaghetti. And I'm just going to keep that on standby. Like, leftover spaghetti is the bomb anyway. So, yeah. And tonight I'm making barbecue chicken. Barbecue chicken legs with macaroni and cheese. Green beans. Dang, I forgot to get... Oh, maybe I got cornbread. Maybe I got a box of Jiffy in there. I meant, because when I was at Walmart, they didn't have any of my dinner rolls. My sister Schubert dinner rolls. They didn't have any of them. I was so sad about it. So I didn't have that. But, I'm going to see. Maybe Babe can go get me some dinner rolls. Or he can see if I got some Jiffy in there. Because I'm like, I just said, I ain't trying to spend no money. I ain't trying to go to no store about it, even though I ain't even trying to buy no dinner rolls. Okay? But that is the dinner for tonight. Because we got practice. So, I know, you know, Babe, she can take a little minute. And they like some big chicken legs. So, I had them in the oven for a nice long time. Do them things with some barbecue sauce. Make a little, like a small pan of macaroni and cheese. Some green beans, more than likely. And get a dinner roll. So, yeah, I shouldn't have to. Like, I can make enough of that for me to have leftovers tomorrow too. Just in case they don't have enough food for us from the class. Like, I think everything that I bought is enough for me to also have leftovers for for work. Except for the pork chops. I'm, I'm, doing, I'm doing pork chops one of these nights. And I think it's only like a four pack. So, but hopefully I'll get there from class. So, yeah. My gas, we filled up on Sundays. So I don't plan on putting gas in my car. Like, I literally don't feel like I, I don't plan on spending any money this week. I want to see. Like, that is a... Y'all, if I can do that, oh honey, I'll be the woman. I will be it. I will be that girl, honey. That is a goal of mine right now. So, I'll let y'all know. I'll let y'all know if I meet my goal of literally not having to buy anything. I'll let y'all know. Yeah, y'all, I'm on the way to work. Going to get this audit done. Um. Just pick y'all back up later on. I do got on clothes. It's like on like this um jumpsuit. It's like a yes, yeah, a jumpsuit, a rumper, whatever you want to call it, jumper. But it is strapless, but it got like the little neck you can tie it around your neck. So yeah, cute for a hot summer day. All right, y'all. So we had Jason's deli for lunch today. So my spaghetti. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the refrigerator. I had in my bag. So. Now I'm already secure. Got lunch. Just in case we don't got it tomorrow, I still got lunch today. I got me a half of a sandwich. This is a club. Some chips, some fruit and vegetables with dip. Mm -hmm. oh, so I'm in the car, back in the car, because that's when you see me. I wasn't in the car that's when you see me. I think I should have my lunch. But um, I'm off now off of work and I am headed to get my kids from school what does have football practice today and I kind of wanted to go but y'all know I'm also like Brit is cooking we cooking every night so the only reason I wanted to go because I saw they have an parent meeting a parent team meeting or whatever and I just feel like I have not been very involved but they're just been like conditioning but you know I'm practicing and stuff you know it hasn't been any games and nothing but I still feel like I haven't been involved. Y'all know with baseball season, I am super, super duper involved. So I did want to go to the parent meeting. But Fortune was like, I'm going to be there, of course. Like, you don't have to worry about trying to do that. Like, just cook and stuff, you know. And he's right, but I don't know. I'm going to see. Because I'm making baked chicken tonight. I think I told y'all already. Baked chicken. Why well, I might make baked beans instead of... I got a can of baked beans, but I don't got no ground beef taken out. Oh, hold on. Let me think. Barbecue chicken. Oh, I said I was going to make some green beans. I can still make the green beans, but 
some baked beans sound good too now that I'm saying it baby that sound kind of good but yeah I kind of want to go to the parent meeting it says 7 o'clock it's 5 14 now I doubt I'm gonna like have to leave my house with food cooking if I decide to try to go to this meeting and we all know I don't know we all, I don't know I'm gonna see I'm gonna see I do want to go though because I just want to be I want to get more active I mean I just say granny fortune be there maybe because he's not a coach this for football he's like a team dad so he's there or just literally watching I don't feel like I like he can also watch with and sincere because they go to auto practices too so I don't know y'all I don't know I'm gonna see I'm out for his crap but I just turned my audit in. It took me literally all day. I literally just turned it in at like 4.55. So, yeah. Finished that. Thank goodness. Done with it. But I just picked up a massive audit that is like 300 pages long. So, I'm like, oh, I fear that this is going to take me all of July. And I really need to get some points on the board. I really need to get some points on the board. I'm in competition with the other auditors. <laughs> We're in competition. We'd be really be in competition. Come on, folks. Now, your girl is trying to get on this highway. But yeah, y'all. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh, that's what I want. My sister. My sister has been asking me about doing a sister's Q and A. Sister's question and answers. I don't know. If, I don't think we just wanted this stick to just like stuff about us and our relationship or anything like that i think it's pretty open discussion i think it's pretty much an open discussion to discuss anything and just getting our point of views on things but yeah she wanted me to ask you all i'm gonna ask via instagram as well so if you all have any questions, it's going to be a Q and a It's just going to be two people answering it, which is going to be me and my sister. You can ask about our relationship, us growing up. I can ask literally anything that y'all might want to know about us, about anything. We're both pretty much open books. I'm going to see, can we film it this weekend? I'm going to see, can we film it this weekend? Um, that'll be the goal. So, like I said, I'm going to ask on Instagram as well for some Q&A questions like no filter she said no filter i was like what type of question like what you you want to talk about she was like no filter like whatever so y'all we're gonna do a late q a so y'all drop y'all questions down below i might put it on the community tab too because everybody the views ain't been right on the vlogs lately mm -mm. the views ain't been right on the vlogs i understand though i mean in a sense i understand where y'all at? At the same time. Where y'all at? The comments. I mean, because let me not even go there. Because I can be like, Brie, if you don't go on somewhere with my comments, when you the main one. But like 20 comments, like 20 comments. That's all I'm saying, like 20 some comments. Like, what is that? What is that? But I guess I can go interact. I'm, I'm going to go interact. Y'all know I'm busy though, y'all. Oh, I'm also. So I am in the process of trying to book a couple trips for people. It's kind of scary, especially this one for my mom's friend. She wants to go to Africa. And so I've been trying to get a quote together for her. It's kind of like this, like going somewhere local, like domestic or even like international. So like the Caribbeans, they're a little easier because like packages are already kind of like offered like oh come get this deal type of thing or you know the resorts it's like i know more about it i guess like i can pretty much like you know with th the normal places you know your punta canas your cancuns your jamaica's your and all type you know all parts of jamaica saloons like packages come up for those a lot like you see great deals on it and you pretty much know the area you know the name of these cities but with africa she gave me like two places and so i'm trying to look and then like some of the excursions she want to do and it's like like it's a little scary but i mean it's been fun looking it up but yeah y'all 
<laughs> yeah, it's like, oh my gosh, it's kind of scary. It's kind of scary, but it's some definitely getting some experience. But yeah, it's a little scary though. However, I'm gonna go home and work on that. Um, so I'm in the process of booking a couple things actually. So we're getting quotes together for a couple things. So yeah, I'm gonna go home cook because mostly like what I'm cooking, like I said, it's gonna be going in the oven. So I ain't gotta really think about it too much. But yeah, I'm gonna go work on travel stuff now. So hopefully we get some good results. <laughs> Hopefully you get some good results. And for everybody, um, if you are interested in booking travel, um, just know, you know, deposits will have to be made. Um, you will have to, like, give me a card authorization to, you know, put down on deposits. I'm going to set dates and have dates for you to pay certain amounts by because, yeah just not I mean it's, it costs everything costs so just be prepared I don't want to waste my time I'm not charging a travel fee at all a book I mean a research fee but I still you know I, so I don't want to waste my time if only if you're serious about booking just if you're hitting me up I'm um, asking about a quote please just know that you're really wanting to do this <laughs> because thing is like have your date in mind have your money I'm not gonna say in ready because you want to know how much you're gonna spend before you have to put but like the deposit will be due like if I give you a quote the deposit will be due like very much soon after because if things change like if you wait too long like more weeks months to try to book I'm gonna have to do the whole process over because more than likely the rates will change like things change so if you're interested in booking a trip just be like deposit ready i would say that be deposit ready and i'm of course i don't know what the deposit will be until the trip is being you know booked and quoted and whatever it says is the, what the deposit is what it is so yeah y'all just a tidbit but i'll talk to y'all in a little bit and look at my kids from school i'm doing renovations in the kids school and it's gonna look so nice here like you know it had flooded a while ago so i had to get stuff done but it just looks so nice and clean the paint everything just looks so good oh the fortune sign woke up they are going to the no. zoo Mommy? huh look at he brought to school today y'all they yeah. had stuffed animal pick that you had a picnic yeah and he got to bring a stuffed animal he brought this giant giraffe y'all know if y'all have been watching me forever, when I had, when I was pregnant with him and I wanted to do his nursery as like a zoo thing, safari thing, mm -hmm. I had spent a lot of money on that. Giraffe, what's today? Oh, the field trip tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I know. Did daddy tomorrow, sign you up? What the heck? Oh, yeah, daddy did sign you up already. Oh, that's cool. What I do? Come on, with that big old giraffe. Now you got practice? Yeah, you got football practice. Oh, and it is 5.34. Yeah. Yeah, football practice today. Right, y'all. Made it home and we're about to get started on this chicken. So I got my chicken chicken in the sink right now because I had to clean it. Y'all know all them little yellow things that be on the back on the bottom on the um on chicken legs. Oh, disgusting. So I cleaned my chicken legs off really good. And now I'm about to season it up. So for the seasonings, we're gonna use some slap your mama. Y'all know this is my favorite. We got onion powder, garlic powder, paprika, black pepper, and I'm going to add, I just I was looking in my pantry for some, we we'll see what seasonings I got, and I had some, I forgot I had some saison up there, so I'm going to add some saison to this as well, and then we're going to, um, we are going to use, I have a variety of sweet baby ray sauces over here, I got some regular barbecue sauce, this one isn't open yet, so I'm going to try to use these two I got open first and see what I can get out of it. But I got honey barbecue sauce, and I also got sweet and spicy. So I'm going to combine these two and see if that's enough. If not, I'm going to go in with the big one. So, yeah, y'all, I'm going to season my chicken up. I am, I was looking up under my cabinet to get a pan out, and I usually use my, like, my glass pan. 
but I saw that I had this and to make for some easy cleanup, even though I'm gonna be using, I'm making baked beans and I'm making macaroni and cheese, I'm gonna still use some pans, but just so we won't have too many pans to clean tonight, I'm gonna use that for the chicken. So yeah, I'm gonna season that up real good. Let's do that now. I'm just gonna season it up in this pan. I mean, I was gonna season it in the sink, but I sleep forgot, so now it's in the pan. That's what we got right now. It may not mean nothing to y'all. Understand nothing was done for me. So I don't plan on stopping at all. I want this shit forever, mine, never mind, never mind. Shut shit down in the mall. It's Sunday, girl, she the one for me. And I ain't even planning the call. I want this shit forever, mine, never mind, never mind. Last name ever, first name greatest. Like a spring ankle, boy, ain't nothing to play with. Started off local, but thanks to all the haters, I know G4 pilots on a first name basis. In your city, faded off the ground. Nino, she insists she got more class. We know, swimming in the money, come and find me. Nemo, if I was at the club, you know I bawled. Chemo, drop the mixtape, this shit sounded like an album. Who would have thought a countrywide tour would be the outcome? Labels want my name beside an X like Malcolm. Everybody got a deal, I did it without one yeah nigga i'm about my business killing all these rappers you would swear i had a hit list everyone who doubted me is asking for forgiveness if you ain't been a part of it at least you got to witness bitches it may not be nothing to y'all understand nothing was done to me so i don't feel no stopping at all i want this shit forever mind never mind never mind shit shit down in the mall it's a nigga girl she don't want to me all right y'all our chicken is nicely seasoned yes 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 y'all see them i went ahead and organized them in the pan i'm just gonna cover it with some foil i got my oven preheated to 400 i like to cook chicken legs i like to cook big chicken period i like to cook chicken period on 400 if i'm baking it it's just I don't know, I feel safer doing so. <laughs> I just feel safer doing so. I don't know. But I'm just gonna cover my pan. I'm gonna go ahead and stand it up right quick. Get some holes in it so it can breathe. little ventilation so that you can get a little ventilation and i'm gonna cook this in the oven for practice over 745 so it's 628 right now um siri thanks siri <laughs> so i'm gonna put it in the oven for an hour and 15 minutes on 400 and i'm, I'm gonna check on it at that hour I'm checking on after hour, and if it's looking if it's looking good to me, then I'll add the barbecue sauce and cook it for another 30 minutes. Or maybe not. We'll see. I play it by ear, okay? I play it by ear. But yeah, we're gonna go for an hour first. Right now, I'm also about to go ahead and boil my noodles for macaroni and cheese and brown my meat. I had went ahead and took out, I had, yesterday when I made spaghetti, I had, um, this ground beef really shot the sh now because it's in a baggie. I had put it in water, put it in some warm water. I know you're not supposed to do that, but when I just, I know I just decided while I was in the car that I was gonna make baked beans. So yesterday when I made spaghetti, I had a little block at the bottom that was still kind of hard. So I was like, I'll just put this up. I didn't know what I was gonna do with it, but I was like, I'll just put it up and just so it happened. Today I decided I wanna make baked beans. So I got just like a small can of baked beans. So it's like only a little bit of ground beef. So it's gonna be a perfect amount of um, meat to go inside of this little small can of baked beans just for us. But I'm about to boil my noodles for macaroni and cheese 
and then I'm going to also make, you know, our sister Schubert dinner rolls. So I've shown y'all how to make macaroni and cheese a few times. Basically, I know people have asked me like, okay, Brie, every time you make it, you making it for uh, an event or whatever. The only thing that you're going to do is be cutting your ingredients in half uh, or to con for the portion that you're needing for it. Like however big your family is. So I am making, hold on, let me get a pot, y'all. Since I'm making it just for us and like probably to have a little bit of leftovers, for myself and for fortune. I think I, I think I made how many chicken this I just made and I like nine. So I plan, okay, so now I was thinking like, okay, babe probably gonna eat two. The boys might eat one, I'm gonna eat one or two. So that's seven for us. And then I made two extra ones, just in case the boys want another one. Maybe I made ten. How many I just made? I don't even know how much I meant to just made. I know I didn't cook the whole pack though. So not really sure, but I'm gonna go ahead and get these noodles boiled. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna be able to go to practice or to the meeting. I need to take Bree and see if she knows. So I don't know if they, I don't know if they went ahead and signed Junior up yet. So I don't know if they know it's a meeting because I don't know if they're in the group, the group me chat. Like he did all the practices. He know what they practice is, but I don't know if they know that it's the meeting today. Unless they said it, they announced it out loud. I know Uncle Junior came down here yesterday. I had that practice. But yeah, y'all. I'm about to um get these noodles on. I had some. I y'all know I like to use the Mueller brand, and I had some. I know I had my because I always buy elbow. I got pasta for days in my cabinet, but I know I had some of my Mueller's brand, and it's a new two pound box. It's like this is a size that I would need if I'm making it, if I'm cooking it for. Like an event or whatever. Or, you know, whatever. But I can I could break the box up. But I also had this box right here. Maybe they was out of Mueller brand. One time I went shopping. So I just bought some Walmart brand. So I'm going to go ahead and just use these tonight. This was a three pound box. It's already open. But, um. I'm just going to use these. Because they're in here. And, you know, when you making when you making it for more people, you want to be fancy, even though like it's just elbow noodles, but you feel like you need to use name brand stuff. For home, I can use this because I got it, and so we're gonna use it. <laughs> we're gonna use it. Our water is getting hot now. I'm gonna go ahead and sauce it up too. I like you gotta season your water, okay? You have to season your water. See, look, I told you I needed salt the other day. This all the salt I got left. So, baby, for this purpose, we are not gonna use our last little bit of our good salt. I also got some pink Himalayan salt in here too. But for this purpose, I remember I had bought these little, this is full too. I had bought this little cheap salt, the little salt shakers. I'm gonna use that for these because we just seasoning the water, baby. We're not gonna use our good stuff. I mean, usually I do. Usually I really do, but for this, we just gonna use that. I guess I'm using my cheap noodles, my cheap salt here, might as well. Huh? But I do got the craft cheese, you already know. Definitely got the craft. Got the craft shredded cheese. Yeah. Let me um I'm gonna let that boil up and I'll show y'all the chicken and everything once that comes out the oven in an hour. But right now I'm gonna get some work done, y'all. While my kids and my husband are gone. I get some work done. And I will talk to y'all in a second. Oh, let me hear that walk on in. He was already out here whining. Like, I didn't want you home when you were going to have me outside. Where you at, Rocco? It, it rained. First of all, my kids got it so junky out here. Like, how you junk up outside? They got toys everywhere. Legos on the table. I didn't know when I let them paint out here. Look at the table. Look at the table now, y'all. It's a painted table. Oh my god. Hey, Rocco. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. The sides are in the oven. We got our macaroni and cheese and baked beans. I just took the chicken out and I'm going to put the um, dinner rolls in as well. I put those in now. 
I'm gonna go ahead and put barbecue sauce on the chicken and let that cook for about 35 minutes. y'all the family is home dinner is done i bet y'all i was on the phone more easy so i already started scooping baked beans out the pan but let me just show y'all what we got for dinner tonight we got some baked beans here we got some dinner rolls we got some macaroni and cheese and we got some barbecue chicken legs about to eat what's going up on a Tuesday. Alright y'all. Time to eat.